Hello again and welcome to the Real Ale Guide. Um, today's beer is Witchcraft Breweries. Sorry, Witchwood Breweries, Witchcraft. Um, good times. The reason we're going to do this Real Ale Guide in the garden is because spring has broken, or more like summer's broken. It's a lovely warm day and what we'll I always believe you've got to have a beer outside in your garden. It's absolutely fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. So yeah, let me show you the beer. Um, lovely looking bottle again. Witchcraft, they've got a nice style about them, the way they make their beers. It's 4.5% in the volume, and it's a award-winning beer, this one. It's the bottle top. And what it says on the back, is our seductive recipe of three hops and three choice malts will tempt and charm you with this wonderfully refreshing and aromatic dry blonde beer. Um, it's actually made in um, Oxfordshire, in Whitney, in Oxfordshire, should I say. It's the old, let me sit down, it's the old Braxbeer Brewery. They've been brewing beers in Braxbeer in the old Bruny Oxford for a long time. They moved it up um, to the Midlands and then they, I think they got bought out by another company and they're making the both, the both beers in this one old brewery, which is absolutely fantastic. Right, let's get, it on, man. get into the you can see. Oh, a bit of, bit of smoke there. Bit of, it's nice, lovely smelling. Let's get it into the glass. Good head, very good head there. I like to say with a real ale guide, um, if I make a mistake, it's in the video. I don't cut it, I leave it all in. So this is how it really is. Um, I much prefer it like that. It's much more human, it's much more natural. People do make mistakes. Just gotta leave them in there. Okay. Um give this beer a go straight away. No messing about. Oh, it's typical, it is a typical blonde beer, a pale ale, it's very, it's very citrusy, it's got a citrus bite to it, and a nice hoppy, hoppy aftertaste, which is fantastic, it's really good. Again, um, Witchwood Breweries, they use a lot of the crystal malts in their beers, it really sharpens up the taste, it's really good. Um, quite a bit of carbonation going on. Nice head. Clings to the glass, lovely. And it goes so well. I, I, I love drinking outside. It just, for me, it's, it's the atmosphere. It's, it's just a, you feel so much freer. Out. I always feel freer outdoors. Get the barbecue lit. Crack open a few beers. This would go down very well. You could buy four, five, six, whatever your temptation. Go out and buy them. Very good. You can get these in your local supermarkets, your stores. You can buy them online. Um, oh, by the way, Witchwood, they've got an online shop. If you want all the bits and pieces, let's have a look. They've got T-shirts, shirts, um, pint tankards, metal steel, good pint tankards, the old-fashioned type with the handle. A bit like this, but metal. Um, what else they do? Pint glasses with the inscriptions on. And they do a range of beers, which I've done in the past, which is Goliath I've done. Have a look at that on the Real Ale Guide. Um, Hobgoblin, Witchcraft, which I'm doing right now. Scarecrow and Circle Master. Now, if you want to get in touch with them, it's www.witchwoodbreweries.com. Sorry, sorry, I've made a mistake. Never mind, we'll leave it in. 
www.witchwood.co.uk and that's towards all your bits and pieces you can order the beers online go for it or if you want to phone them it's 01993 890 800 okay let's give this beer another taste It's really good. It is really good. Citrus comes through straight away. It's, it's such a lovely, lovely, fresh tasting beer. Um, I haven't cooled it down. It's come straight out of the cupboard. So your preference, whether you cool it up or, or in the fridge or you have it just out of the cupboard. But it is probably about 10 degrees, which is a nice temperature to drink a beer, I'd say. <coughs> Pardon me. Um, Marston's own Witchwood. Marston's they do the pedigree um, and they, they do the banks is bitter which very very good they got a few um, real ales on the on the cask ales so if you watch some of my re reviews you've got the Marston's here your break beers and, all, and most of your Witchwood breweries beers now so you've got the whole range of beers there um, it's one of the oldest the brewery is one of the oldest in the country um, it's worth, they do a brewery tour if you live in the UK, if you want to have a look. It's quite quite interesting. It's down in Oxfordshire, Whitney in Oxfordshire. It's probably worth a go. You, you know I mean, they do tasters and bits and pieces. Or you can take take beer away with you, fresh off the cask. Very, very good. Okay. Hmm. I'm going to rate this beer now. Which were breweries, witchcraft. I'm going to give it a big 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10. Very, very good beer. Strong tasting. Um, citrusy, hoppy. It's got the whole works. It's very, very nice. Okay. Thanks for watching The Real Ale Guide. I'm going to do as many reviews as possible in the future. I've got quite a few reviews on, on YouTube now if you want to take a look at them. Um, big range of beers from your stouts to, to your light ales to your, your dark ales they're all there give them a watch rate them and if you like subscribe to my channel thanks for watching the real ale guide check you out soon goodbye now